Hello, I'm Dr. Nicholas Perricone, and it's a pleasure to be speaking with you today. So this antioxidant that's derived from the pine bark of this French maritime tree is called pycnogenol. And pycnogenol has tremendous benefits. And it's unique because of the, once again, it's specific to certain organ systems. Pycnogenol binds selectively to collagen. Now this is a dermatologist's dream. You know, collagen is what makes up our skin, the matrix of our skin. And what pycnogenol binds specifically to collagen, it can help rejuvenate collagen in many ways and protect us from things like sun damage. When we go out in the sun, in a certain amount of time, depending on how light our complexion is, we can actually get red. When you take pycnogenol, it actually delays the onset of that redness because it's giving us what we call photoprotection. It's scooping up those bad free radicals that are triggering an inflammatory response. So pycnogenol, by binding selectively to the skin, is, is absolutely important to us. Pycnogenol, though, also affects other organ systems. Pycnogenol can greatly reduce our risk of cardiovascular disease because it controls the amount the blood vessels dilate. And that's a healthy thing. There's something called nitric oxide synthase, which is a long term, for an enzyme that actually controls the kind of constriction our blood vessels see. When we take pycnogenol, we actually get healthier circulation to all of our organ systems, especially to the skin. So we can measure the amount of oxygen skin cells are getting, and it goes up dramatically when we're taking pycnogenol. It also reduces a waste product called carbon dioxide in the skin. And so what we want to do is maintain good levels of oxygen and low levels of carbon dioxide, because when we have high levels of carbon dioxide and low oxygen, the skin wrinkles more quickly. A perfect example of that is someone who's a cigarette smoker. Every time we take a puff of one cigarette and inhale it, we produce a trillion free radicals that circulate in our body. It also causes constriction of the blood vessels, so vasoconstriction with a puff of a cigarette. That chronic restriction of oxygen flow to the skin leads to wrinkles. I remember distinctly in my residency program in dermatology, they actually showed a slide, a photo, of a set of identical twins. And there was a smoker and a non-smoker who lived in the same geographic location, had the same lifestyle. And yet the smoker looked 20 years older than the non-smoker, just from that one factor. It's because of creation of free radicals and vasoconstriction. So pycnogenol can actually increase circulation to the skin. It also works in the lower extremities. So pycnogenol can be taken before long airline flights to help prevent those blood clots that can form in our legs. Pycnogenol is good for what we call peripheral artery disease. And so pycnogenol is really, truly one of those miracle antioxidants, anti-inflammatories that's readily available to us.